Fashion Nova tried it. These are trash. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For those who are new here, my name is Be Natalie, and this is gonna be another Fashion Nova haul. A lot of people keep asking me to do another Fashion Nova haul, and I just don't understand why you guys don't see that their pants are not for, well, their denim are not for taller women. Like, it's just not for us. I don't really think anything has changed in the last six months, but I'm gonna give it a go just for you. In this haul, I bought six pairs of jeans, well, I bought five pairs of jeans and one pair of pants, so we're just gonna give it another test shot and we'll see what happens. I feel like I gave them a good try, twice already, and tops are okay, but when it comes to bottoms, they're lacking in the denim department for tall women, but I'm gonna give it one more go, and you guys can see how, it, how this pans out. I don't really have much hope. I really don't. Like, I'm just gonna show you guys, just so you can't say I didn't give it a good try. I expect to fully send everything back tomorrow, but I'm gonna give them a chance. Maybe they've extended some inseams in the last six months, so who knows. And since you're already here, you might as well take this time out to subscribe, because I know you wanna see future videos. Just, just do it, subscribe, subscribe. And don't forget to like and comment. Now let's not waste any more time and see if Fashion Nova is going to waste my time and let's get started. Okay, so the first pair of pants, first pair of jeans I should say, are the Seek and Destroy jeans in a size 7 and the color is Light Stone. Um, surprisingly, they're actually like just reaching my ankle, so they're not that bad. Yeah, they're not that bad, but I could, I could do with two more inches, but like... It wouldn't kill me to wear these, which I'm actually surprised, but two more inches, you know, just two more inches. Come on, guys, we can do it. And they fit really well. I'm a size 7 in all Fashion Nova, so this makes sense. Just a little history, I believe in my last haul, the denim was a no-go, but the pants were, like the blue flared pants, but the denim was always too short for me. And in my first haul, I think half the denim worked and the other half didn't. So it's it's really a crapshoot. You don't know what you're gonna get. I feel like if they were tighter around the ankle, I wouldn't be complaining, but since they have that light kind of baby flare going on, looks a little funny for the length. But I don't know, they still look good on the hip and the butt. These are the high waist skinnies in white size 7 and I really didn't expect them to be long enough. They're pretty high water. They look fugazi as heck. Like they're super thin. You can, I don't know if you can tell on camera, but you can see the pockets and you can kind of like make out my skin through these. I am not feeling them at all. They're pretty cheap. Kind of remind me of the white pants I tried from Pretty Little Thing. I just have no luck with white pants. Like, I don't think I'm ever gonna have a pair of white pants that are long, thick, and not see-through, and don't feel cheap. I just give up on white pants. So these are the Keep It On The Hush jeans in dark, size seven as always. Um, they fit well around the waist. Actually, these are jagging. I didn't know they were jagging when I put them in my car. They're not an actual jean. They feel like a jagging, like they're super thin and the pockets are fake, just like a jagging. And they're super short. They are high waters galore. Not my cup of tea. Like if you can see this ankle bone, that means they're too short for you. Then it's doing a weird flare thing at the ankle. Like they look dumb. I don't even think 5'9 can get away with these. Like, <laughs> this ain't it. Okay guys, so these are the Corinne cargo pants in a size medium in the color khaki. And they're ridiculously too short for me. Like, they stop right here. Like, this looks ridiculous. Like, I know they're scrunched at the bottom like a jogger. They're supposed to be shorter than regular pants, but these are ridiculously too short. This is embarrassing. Like, I would never go out in the street like this. Never. And I really was trying to hold out hope on these because, you know, cargo pants are in right now. They're on trend. And I don't have any, so these are a no. And I still don't have any. Like, come on. Now, imagine if I had sneakers on with this and, and the length was, and this is the length, like, 
ridiculous. We have one. We have a winner. These are the Game Changer jeans in the light wash, size 7, and they're actually long enough like you can't see the ankle bone, like ankle bone is covered. These work. I'm, I'm, I'm shocked. Something I can keep. Like they fit very snug, like they are a little snugger than the other pants I tried on, but you know, it's not that bad. And they're super stretchy, you know, Fashion Nova material, made to stretch, but I'm liking these. Too bad they're just plain blue denim, like why can't I get some variety, like some ripped denim, colored denim, like I can get plain blue denim in a suitable length from almost anywhere. And the fact that this is the only thing so far that has worked is kind of annoying. No, it's really annoying. They are long enough for me, but I would say that's about it. If you're 5'11", I wouldn't do it, but for 5'10", it is just the right length. Like, any taller and you're screwed. Everything I bought was high-waisted. Sorry if you're not into high-waisted. That's my thing right now. It's probably going to be my thing for an another couple of years I don't do low rider I need to suck all this into something <laughs> all right guys we got another winner these are the glistening jeans in black and they are size 7 they are long enough for me again if you're 5 11 and up I wouldn't get these but if you're 5 10 you know, these will work. They're just covering the ankle bone. They're not as long as the last pair, but you know, they're they're just there. Um, they're not bad size fit wise. Like they're good fit. They're a little sh shorter at the waist than I prefer. Like you can see my belly button poking out. Um, I like it above my belly button, but they're not bad. The only thing I would say the quality isn't the greatest on these. They are very thin, like very thin. Like I wouldn't call them jeans. If I were selling them, I'd say pants or jegging. I wanted to give another pair of Distressed Denim from Fashion Nova a chance because in my first, very first video, which was a Fashion Nova haul, I bought black denim which were long enough but they were the biggest lint magnet and I did not notice how bad the lint magnet of the pants were. I did not notice how bad the lint problem was until I went outside in, in natural light and I looked like I was rolling in a pit of cotton balls like it was OD crazy. So this was the sixth and final item and it actually works so that means two out of six which is pretty bad. So two out of six items actually worked for me, which is pretty bad, statistically speaking, because two out of six, like, what's the problem, Fashion Nova? We need more options. Basically, I can't even give you a yes or no on Fashion Nova. I personally won't try it again because it's a crapshoot. You don't know what you're going to get. It's just guess. It's a guess. It's a complete guessing game. Like, if I tr you tried it once, you tried it enough times. I need guarantees that pants are going to be long enough for me to keep trying to buy them from you. Like, if you're not going to tell me the inseam, I'm going to try once. If it doesn't work, that's it. I only did this again for you guys out there who keep asking, but I ain't doing it again. Now, for the sake of the theme of my channel, I only tried on the bottoms, but you can tell from my last video, I do appreciate the tops from Fashion Nova. Like, those you can keep buying. Like, that, I, I, they work, you know? Good quality. They fit very well. I don't have any problems with that. But the bot is just the bottoms. The bottoms are a crapshoot. You don't know. Now I hope this video was helpful for those of you who keep asking. You know, you're always welcome in my comment section. If anyone has any questions, direct them to the comment section. I'm pretty good at answering um, back fairly quickly. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. And always keep a lookout for future Tall Girl editions because I'm just going to keep them coming. If I find a brand that I'm interested in, I'm going to give it a shot. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Bye!